Guten Tag, Aloha. Welcome back today, you guys. It's such a sad, sad day. Not for me. Well, I guess for me, not for you guys, for me. The reason why. Today, <laughs> today I'll be reading from my 12 year old diary. Now let's just take a moment to just appreciate this binder. Look at it. I'll never tell. Isn't that adorable? Not really. But um, you guys, I haven't even opened this probably since I've written in it. And um, I opened it up, saw somebody's name, oop, closed it real quick. So um, at that moment I was like, maybe I should read it, but I didn't want to read it alone, I guess. That's why I'm recording it with you guys. So, yeah. Um, uh, first off, don't judge me. I don't want nobody judging me. I don't be judging nobody else. Don't judge me for what my 12 year old mom was going through. Cause she was 12. She was, I don't know what she was. We're gonna find out in a second. But uh, let's just, uh, I don't want to open this. I really don't. <sighs> I was so emotional. Okay, let me just let's just read. I'm just reading a book. Okay. All right. When I open it up, I see all this graffiti on there. You see, love, hate, problems, tears, hate. Oh, I see some names. Okay, um, I think I will, I probably will never ever see these people again, but I know there's one name in here that I still see now. I'm just gonna give him a nickname. All right, but let's just get started. Yeah. Oh, look, it's sticking together like, y'all nasty. All right, so it says Monday, August, Mon I can't, I'm dyslexic. Monday 13th, August 7, right here, in the top right hand corner. Oh, okay, so that was 10 years ago. I'm so old. Dear Journal, I'm so professional. Dear Journal, today was the most devastating day ever. Oh, now I'm sad. What happened? No book. I only saw about six of my friends. <laughs> All my teachers are boring except one. And I had to carry like four heavy books all day. Look, see, I was not thinking about college at this time. I have to carry more than four books or had to carry more than four books. And I'm stressing over six friends. I don't even talk to nobody on a daily basis. Like, my arms were hurting so much that I couldn't lift them. Miriam, hi, Miriam. I spelled your name all types of wrong. Um, Miriam asked me. <laughs> okay, I already see his name, so we're gonna call him Bone. He'll probably know what that means, but nothing nasty. You guys are nasty. Miriam asked me if I talked to Bone because it's been so long. Bone cut his hair, and Jordan grew an afro. I don't know who these people are. I also got confused at the end. I'm confused now. We ended up going to the YMCA. Oh, that's where I saw Houston and Sapphire. Okay, I remember Sapphire. I don't know who Houston is. I think that's, I don't know, okay. I think today was an quote unquote okay day. All right, uh, moving on. All right, August, it was blank, by the way. My handwriting is so crap, or it was crap. It is such better now, such better. And Dear Journal, today was an okay day. I think I made three new friends, two boys and one girl. I saw a bone again and I think he said hi, but I'm not sure. What? I finally, in all caps, I finally saw Dana, Karen, Taylor, or Tyler, and Felicia today. Bye. I found out where Katie lives. I was a stalker and we talked a lot on the bus. I thought I saw Alan today. Oh my God. 
You guys, okay, so I remember I used to have this crush on this guy named Alan. Like, it was crazy. I'm pretty sure he's in here a lot. How long does this go through? I don't know if he moved or not because I never see him at school. I will have to see him tomorrow. I think I like last year way better. Uh huh. Oh, little 12 year old number that we know about trials and tribulations on the way. All right, this is the next day, the 15th of Wednesday. Dear Journal, today Bone finally talked to me. He said, hey Nova. And at the end of the day, I asked him what happened to his arm. He said he broke his thumb. Oh my God, he's gonna know what I'm talking about. I fell, sorry, I fell, F-E-L-L, -L, sorry for him. That person, I don't know why I quoted that person, in math was making fun of someone. It was so funny. I'm just, I'm just talking. I really wrote every single day. Bone asked me to ask Jasmine for her burrito. She already ate it. It was funny. Today in math class, I didn't get to see Brad because someone's head was in the way. Today, Brad looked at me three times. What kind? So I have one that ends with, wow, a really great day. So I'm just gonna read this one out. Um, Dear General, today at the end of the, a little, today at the end of the day, Brad was making things with his hands. I was pretty, it was pretty funny. Brad was pretending to hit Carol. Darren was looking at me, LOL. I was trying to make him, what am I talking about? George looked at me once, Nez, okay, and science, Nez was looking at me. What? Why was it so important that people looked at me? He kept looking behind his seat, looked at me, looked at, oh my God. Why was it so important that people looked at me? I swear, Nova. And the first thing I see is, is in all caps, and it says, I am so stupid. What? Oh my God, Nova, why did you talk to me? Today, Brad looked at me, and then I looked at him inside. Again, with his looking at people. And then he turned his head really fast. Weird. I heard myself in orchestra. My friend Courtney told the teacher I was bleeding. Before I went to the clinic, Darren asked me, what is bleeding? I didn't answer. I am so stupid. Why? What happened? In Spanish, we learned how to play cards. Um, and then more staring at people. Why did I call myself stupid? I'm not stupid. Okay, so I skipped all the way to January 9th, 2008. Um, okay, dear journal, OMG, I'm so happy. I found out that Darren didn't move. I don't know why that was so important. Um, he went out of town and his car broke. Why do I need to know all of this? And they're kind of stuck. Oh, I was happy about that, apparently. Um, I took Kevin's book to turn it to the right page. Martinez gave everyone at my table a peppermint. What is with this extracurricular thing I'm saying? Um, even though I don't like him, I took it anyway. In Spanish, Corey was staring at me. Half the people, ew, half of these people that I say were staring at me probably were not. First of all, I had a problem. I was rubbing his abs and I spelled it A-B-B-S. <laughs> then I started tickling him. Ew, why was I touching people? Y'all, I have some problems. Um, dear journal, today was awesomely cool. And I spelled both of those wrong. I'll start with Carl. Who is Carl? I don't remember Carl. I just, I don't know, it was I don't I told him about the phone, he said not to tell and anyone. He kept looking at me weird and science. Nez looked who are, okay, so I got Nez, uh, Carl, Darren, who else was it? I don't remember who I'm talking about. Jeff was winking at me. No one winks at you. Um, at the table next to me, Miss 
Davenport, I'm guessing that's my teacher's name. Uh, where's out, was out the room. So I said, who are you staring at? <laughs> they all turned around. Tiffany told me to look at him. I said, no, what am I talking about? I have no, my brain hurts. Sorry I didn't write you yesterday. I'm apologizing to a book. I had too much on my mind. <laughs> I had too much on my mind as, as at 12 years old. 12 years old, really? I had too much on my mind, really? I would love to have what I had on my mind then now. Cause what I have on my mind now, it's way too much. Way, way up too much. I saw Darren looking at me. Again, these people probably are not looking at you. I still think he likes me, but not as much as Keezy. I don't know what that says. I just have to get over him. <laughs> I just pictured we were in a full blown relationship, obviously. Cause I had to get over him. <laughs> you being extra. You guys, so I'm looking through this. And this is like, I had so much, like I put so much emphasis on trying to see somebody or making sure I did everything right for somebody else. Oh my God. Like when you're young, and like I guess your home your hormones just start coming out and whatnot. It is crazy how much you put on little things like talking to someone or like making eye contact with people. Dang, it was hard growing up, y'all. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. This was from December 13th. Again, I'm talking about someone looking at me, which I don't know why. Today, Darren looked at me once in science, and I have a frowny face. Also in science, me and Montanez were talking about after the concert. He asked me, did my mom pick, I'm sorry, I don't know how to read. <laughs> All right, y'all, I'm gonna read like one or two more, then I can't, cause I can't. I don't want to anymore. Okay, this is from March 29th. Uh, dear journal, I'll start off with yesterday. Me and Nez bonded, and I put quotes on the word bonded for whatever reason. Um, we talked a little on our way to aquarium. Oh, so this was Friday. And at CC Pizza, oh, we went on a field trip. I'm guessing, field trip. Um, we were talking about everyone being a family. It was pretty funny, okay. Here's the most amazing part. And I put four Z's in the word amazing, so you know it was lit. Um, Darren and Armand, I don't know who these people are, um, did a rap for a talent show. Dang, Friday was lit, okay. Um, he looked so fine. He had a do-rag, a silver chain, and a tux jacket. Why he sound like Flavor Flav? Okay. Whoa, the finest. Oh Lord, okay. Um, when they were done, they ran across the stage all happy. Armand had jumped off the stage and he fell. <laughs> Me and Lamarcus started cracking up and I gave him two hugs. So warm. So sexy. <laughs> oh my God. Lamarcus kept touching me and trying to kiss me once. But I know he was playing. He kept trying to make me laugh. Okay, so here's what I see. So, Lamarcus and Darren are like a protagonist and an antagonist. Darren is the bad guy, Lamarcus is the good guy. And you know, girls don't like good guys. So I was going after Darren, and I said, Darren was so fine. Girl, I can't with myself. All right, I can't. No more. Nope, I'm done. I'm done. I'm not going to embarrass myself no more. <laughs> You thought like subscribe if you want to see this face more because I know you do. Um, you guys have a good day. Goodbye. But you must have been mistaken with them statements that you make. Huh?